Hi guys, so um, I watched the video from yesterday and I realized that uh, some of my words were a little wacko. Um, when I did this, what I meant to say was you can do this with dry hair, you just need to spritz it a little bit to make it damp. Um, I said you can do it with wet hair, which I had already said. Um, I haven't let my hair dry. Well, you can tell like I'm a little bit of a crazy sleeper because <laughs> it gets a little bit, Ooh. but for the most part, it stays pretty well. Um, I'm getting a little bit anxious because I've been having headaches. Like all last night I had headaches and today and last night I took, um, bath and Epsom salts. Um, I've just been hearing so much about Epsom salts that I was like, well, I'll give it a try. Um, so I took a bath and that kind of like messed up the back a little bit because it got wet. Um, but for the most part, this is what it looked like when I woke up. But I'm very anxious to take it out because when I have headaches, I don't like anything to be in my hair. So I'm um, trying to think of anything else crazy I said in the video yesterday because <laughs> it really didn't make any sense. But another thing I wanted to mention was um, these headbands, they have a seam um, usually on the inside. If you see it here, um, try, try to have that be, um, out. Cause if you wear it, um, this way, it can sometimes leave a little mark there. And you think you can see mine a little bit or just my wrinkles. But anyways, so, um, I just wanted to show you taking it out. I was just going to take it out and then show you because, um, but it's a little bit harder than you think it was, would be like when I first did it, I was like, oh my gosh, I got it like caught in my um hair but um i don't it's my hair is gonna be a little bit wet which is fine because i'll just let it air dry out but if you can see like look how crazy the curl is like i can't even do that with the curling iron that well but i usually do all of this by hand and you can spray it with hairspray i don't like really products in my hair so i tend to just leave it like this and um, let it air dry the rest of the way and all I do is just kind of like neaten this area out because it gets kind of a little bit crazy when I sleep on it but if you're not a crazy sleeper then it's not a big deal and then I um, I'll like braid this part and put it back or I'll just bobby pin it back if it's doing this or something else crazy um, you can always just like curl it I guess if you want I usually just stick it behind and then the only thing I usually do is like I just brush the ends so they're kind of a little bit neater and just together and not frizzed at all my hair is kind of long so but uh, that's all I do with it but if you wanted to get um, bigger curls you can just separate your curls and just kind of let them out a little bit and then just kind of go through with your hands and I can give you a bigger look what I love best about this look and I mentioned this yesterday see like this curls all together you can kind of just separate it and you can get really big curls um, but putting my hair up in a ponytail I love because I can kind of just throw it up and then it has all these like adorable um, like ringlet curls which are so cute every wondering I shave part of my head like kind of like Ellie Goulding so don't freak out um, <laughs> I don't have like brain cancer or anything um, so I that's what I love about it but it's also just like super cute wearing it down and no heat like you don't have to put any heat on your hair and it gives you these awesome fun um, beautiful curls and you just play with it a little bit um, however you like it. See, now I'm like, I wish I hadn't pulled out all these curls because I like it a little bit neater, but, <laughs> but if you want like big fun hair and then you can, um, I don't have any fun headbands, like the fun headbands that you can wear. You can put like a fun, like pretty one that has like a fun, pretty, you know, like the little thing. You can put that in your hair and have it all like indie cute looking. So that's it. I'm like dying to put my hair up in just ponytail. Um, 
So I hope you guys like this uh, hair tutorial and um, I hope it works out for you guys. I would love to see pictures and hear how it goes. Um, if you could subscribe to my channel, I put out videos every day, hopefully. So far I've been doing a really good job and I'm going to do 365 days in my life with chronic pain. So um, it would be so awesome to experience that with you. And um, also if you'd give it a thumbs up or thumbs down if you don't like the video. <laughs> You have a right, but I like you more if you give a thumbs up. No, I'm just kidding. Thumbs up, thumbs down for the video. Um, actually, really, if you would just give me a thumbs up, I really like it. Um, just to know you guys are watching it and enjoying the videos, or if you guys like when I do more beauty stuff or more talking about exactly what goes on with fibro, that just gives me a better idea and direction. If you want to contact me, I'll put that information down below in the description box. And if you have any questions or ideas for tutorials or just want to share your journey with me, just contact me at any of those um, or leave a comment. And um, hopefully I'll see you guys tomorrow. And thanks for sticking with me with my curly hair.